know that song, uh, Gucci Man. So all these girls excited. everybody and welcome back to my channel and if you are new here it is simply welcome to my channel today guys we have a requested video this video was requested by the fabulous Ava Francis Ava is one of my loyal supporters the minute we met we clicked Ava is also a style and fashion maven as well as a personal stylist she has over 25 years in the fashion industry so you already know when I met her I was already trying to ride her coattail right so she's giving me so much advice. Just She was just an amazing person, guys. And so I just wanted to take the time to dedicate this video to her. So if you guys wanna see how I style some of these really cute monochromatic looks that will take you from the summer into the fall, then keep on watching. Okay guys, let's get into look number one. Look number one is a couple of pieces, I, like the pants I had already, and then I purchased the top from Ross. The top was $11.99, and then the pants were probably $20 from ASOS, but I bought these about four years ago. Um, I absolutely love this look together. Um, this is not, a, you know, to me, like the mauve, that deep mauve, a dusty pink. This is not a look that you would typically see someone wearing all together which is why I absolutely love it because it is a little bit different so yeah when we talk about pulling together monochromatic looks um taking you out of the summer into fall I absolutely love this look this like mauvey pink now I'm gonna be honest with you I would also wear this in the winter time well not the winter but in the fall I will put on a light pink a uh, light blazer probably within the same color family and I will just rock this together so yeah guys I absolutely love this look now with the pants the pants are super high-waisted super high-waisted because I did get these in a tall and so they go all the way up and not only do they go all the way up as you can see they actually have a lot of fabric around the ankle area and I just absolutely love these so if you're in the market for something like this I would just say go on to Google and um, Google super high waist pants and you can find something like this um, corset the corset the top style that's definitely in you guys can achieve this look with any color it doesn't necessarily have to be the uh, dusty pink or the deep mauve color but um, yeah this is definitely a really cute look so yeah guys this is going to be look Number one. All right, guys, let's get into look number two. Look number two is so cute. I absolutely love this. Y'all, y'all know what this look remind me of. <laughs> y'all know that song, uh, Gucci Man. So all these girls excited. remind me of them so yeah let's <laughs> let's get into it so I basically paired these gorgeous cute little powder blue slacks uh, with a crop top and a bralette so let's get into it we're gonna start with the pants and we're just gonna work our way up so guys these pants were purchased at Texas thrift I purchased these pants for $9.99 and I paired it with this really cute little belt. These belts are, I purchased three of these belts at one time from Burlington Coat Factory. They came in a three pack and uh, the belts were $7.99. And then I paired it with this little, um, I bought this little bralette from, from Ross. This bralette was $4.99. And it's just, you know, it's just a plain little bralette, you know, nothing special, just a plain little bralette. And then I paired it with this really cute off the shoulder um, top that I purchased from ASOS. Now guys, these purchases were made three different times um, throughout the year. So I did purchase this stuff this year, but it was like, one part was at the beginning of the year the other part was a few months later and i did not purchase these things to go together i just happened to when i was styling and looking for pieces in my wardrobe to style this video uh put together monochromatic looks i kind of came up with this i absolutely love this 
blue look. Another thing that I like about it is that I feel that anyone can wear this. And the reason why I say that is because for all my ladies out there who feel like they cannot wear a crop top, I'm about to dispel that myth right now. Because number one, I don't have like a super flat stomach. So I'm able to rock this and let me show you how to do it as well. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna head down to your local Ross, Burlington Co. Factory, TJ Maxx, Walmart, Target. You gonna head down to your local store and you're gonna go look at or look for a bralette. So you're gonna look for like cute little bralettes or whatever because what, ha what happens is when you pair the bralette under a crop top, it gives you a little bit more length, right? Okay, so it gives you a little bit more length or if, you, if you're still not comfortable with adding a, a crop top or a bralette under a crop top, guys, you know you can do this with a bodysuit as well. So for example, if I was to pull this down a little bit more, look, look at that and you still get, I'm gonna try to pull it down a little bit more, just to kind of give you guys um, an idea of what it would look like. So just imagine if that was like a bodysuit. You can still achieve that really cute crop top look with a bodysuit or even with like this cute little uh, a bralette. And then all you do after that, you just put on your little cute little crop top on top of it and then you just go. So yeah guys, like, don't be afraid to uh, play with color. That's the whole concept, uh, concept of monochromatic looks. As long as it's in the same color family, you can play around with so many different things. I absolutely love this look. It's so crisp and so clean looking to me. And then it's too, it, it's stylish. And then of course, you know, it has a little bit of sex appeal as well. So yeah, guys, um, don't be afraid to play around with color. I absolutely love this look. This is gonna be our So Icy Powder Blue, and this is gonna be look number two. All right, guys, let's get into look number three. So look number three is just this really gorgeous rust color. This is absolutely a color that can take you into the fall. I absolutely love it. And guys, believe it or not, this entire outfit was under $10. I did purchase this outfit at Value Village and I purchased it all at once because I knew, like when I found the pants, I found the pants first, the pants were $5.20. And as soon as I found the pants, I was like, well, let me go try to find a top to go to it because I knew it wouldn't necessarily be easy to you know match these pants or whatever because the color you know the color is not um you know a color that's really popular things are that are not as easy easy to find so i went after i found the pants i went into the next section and i just started kind of looking through everything and lo and behold i found the top guys these these two pieces are made by two totally and completely different companies and so after i found the top and then I, after I found the top, I went and I kind of started looking through the belt section and was able to find this cute little belt. So yeah, guys, again, and, oh, the belt was a dollar. The top was $2.70. So yeah, the, this complete look was under $10, but this is actually one of my favorite looks. So yeah, you can take this look um, out of the summer only because, you know, you have the shoulder action, you have the crop top, and then you have a paper bag waist. Um, but you can take this from the end of summer into early fall. I have Absolutely love this look um, as far as the bottom of the pants they are a little bit cropped and they're like a dressy so these are more like a dressy um a dressy jogger and I absolutely love these because they are dressy they have a really cute paper bag waist another thing that I like about this look despite the fact that it is monochromatic is that the pants come up really really high and so although this is a crop top you're not showing too much um you know you're not showing too much of your waistline and then look at this top guys this is so adorable for under three dollars you cannot beat this look at that look at the bell sleeves on that and then the the cute little ruffle like the ruffle around the top definitely complements the ruffle on the top of the pants i absolutely love that and then um i just like how you know how everything pairs together let me give you guys another pro tip when you guys go thrifting and you are looking for your uh, monochromatic pieces, my advice is to 
um, make sure that you guys are trying to buy everything together if you're wanting the colors to be very similar. Um, other, you know, like the first, that ice blue look that we put together, you know, that was like different variations of, of uh, blues. And so it still complemented each other. But if you get a really, a really, um, I don't know why I can't talk today, but anyway, if you get a really uh, color that's, you know, a little bit different, try to find something while you have that piece with you um, in the moment or in the store. Try to find something at the same time um, so you can kind of pair those things together and then you don't get, you know, you don't go purchase the pants and then, you know, a month or two later, you're starting to look for something and you don't have the pants with you. You can't quite remember the color and then you purchase a top and it's all the way off. So yeah, that's just a pro tip for when you are looking, when you are styling or uh, putting together pieces or colors that are not as easily uh, put together like these deep rust and you know how sometimes blacks can be off or oranges and you know, things like that. But yeah, I lucked out on this look and I absolutely love it. So yeah, guys, this is going to be look number three. All right, guys, can we get into look number four? Look number four is my absolute favorite look, so let's get into it. So guys, I actually paired these pants uh, from Ross. I literally just purchased these pants from Ross, I wanna say on Monday. These pants were $9.99, and they are a faux suede. They are a crop pants, but they are so adorable. I absolutely love them. Um, I paired it with this belt. I think I've worn this belt in quite a few of my hauls. I want to say this belt was one or two dollars, or, or maybe even four dollars. But it, four dollars max is probably what I paid for it. And I'm pretty sure I got it from the Goodwill. And then, of course, guys, I paired it with this adorable leather top. This top was purchased from ASOS. I think I might have purchased this top last year during the panorama. I saw it, it was on sale and I had to have it. Never wore it before. I knew I wanted something cute to go with it, but I just didn't know what. Uh, this top was actually $19.99 and I did get it for an additional 25% off. And so, yeah, I absolutely love this. So I paired this, uh, this entire look together literally the other day. Um, I played around with a lot of different textures, like we got the suede, we have the leather, and then of course we have the faux animal uh, skin on the belt. I absolutely love this. Now guys, if you can't find um, something similar, that's perfectly okay. What I would suggest that you do is just uh, pair, you know, just different variations of browns or caramels or camel colors together and not like because it's a neutral color it really doesn't matter like these colors of course it's not uh, on camera it probably is showing that it's off but the color the color is a little closer together than maybe what it's reflecting on the camera so yeah don't be afraid to play around with color even if it is a little bit off another thing that i wanted to stress is to not be afraid to play around with like different mixing suede and leather now of course i'm not going to suggest that you wear this look right now especially if you live in the south because it's still super hot here but this is absolutely something that i would take into the fall maybe even an early winter but you, of course an early texas winter because we know a Texas winter is completely different than a winter, you know, anywhere else because I guess here, the winter time here is like, what, 65 degrees? That's kind of cold to us. <laughs> So yeah, I absolutely love this look. Another thing that I wanted to, another pro tip that I wanted to give is that um, if you want to achieve something like this, guys, all you really have to do is just find something with a very exaggerated sleeve. I think that's the thing that really just sets this look off and makes it look, it makes it look so sophisticated is that really exaggerated sleeve. I absolutely love it. Another thing you can do with that, like if you find something like this with the exaggerated sleeve, but if this has elastic in it, but you can always wear it off the shoulder or you can do something like an asymmetrical look. So not only are you walking in with a monochromatic, that whole, you know, just that, that, that unified look because it also makes you look smaller. You're also walking in and with a little bit of style, you know, you come in in the room just, you know, walking in on them like that, you know. <laughs> so I absolutely love this. Um, I was gonna tell y'all, what else was I gonna tell you guys about this look? Let me see. So I talked about um, mixing different neutral colors together because that's gonna give you a nice look. We talked about um, 
you know, mixing together different textures like leathers and suede and animal print. I'm trying to think what else. So, oh, you know what? That's what I was gonna say. <laughs> Getting back into the top, like I was saying, you can always, like if you wanna achieve something like this, you can, now this is cropped by the way. Guys, all you have to do is just go into your local thrift store. You wanna look through the blouses because what I noticed like at the thrift stores, they have so many blouses that have those really over exaggerated sleeves. I don't know if it's from the 70s or the 80s, but guys, they have so many of those. All you have to do is purchase something like that, get it back to the house. Of course, uh, you know, you're gonna do your, whatever your routine is when you're prepping and washing your clothes after you get them home from the thrift store. And then just crop it, just literally cut the bottom of it off and then stitch the bottom hem, the bottom. If you don't want to do all of that, take it to your seamstress. And you guys can achieve a look very, very similar to this. Now, it may not be leather, but that's perfectly fine because what gives this look the dramatics is really the sleeve. So basically, get you a cute little top, make sure that the sleeve is exaggerated, bring it home, crop it, and then put it on with a really cute fitted pair of slacks that's fitted from the ankle. You know, you wanna make sure that it's, the, you know, it's fitted at the ankle and it just gives you that really slim look. Yeah, and so this is a pretty easy look to achieve, but I absolutely love it. So yeah, guys, this is gonna be look number four. Okay guys, can we get into our last and final look? This is gonna be look number five. And I absolutely love this. It is so cute, so let's get into it. All right, so I purchased these Army Green leather pants from ASOS. Uh, these pants were made by a company called Collusion, and these pants were only $40. Um, I then purchased this cute little tank top. Um, this was actually a part of a three-piece set, so it came with the crop top, the long uh, long cardigan and a pair of like fitted flared leggings, I guess. And I purchased this in the entire set from Value Village for $7. So I guess that we'll just say the top was about, we'll just say the top was about $225, $250. So $250 is just a, a plain little tank top um, that's ribbed. And then guys, I purchased this military style blazer from the Salvation Army. This blazer was $8.99 and then it was additional 50% off that particular day. So this blazer was only $4.50 and I think it is so cute. So yeah, I wanted to pair this cute little green set together. Um, it definitely gives me like a military vibe, but I love the variations of textures and colors. And so yeah, um, I put this together, um, you know, as the last and final look because I knew that this was going to take us directly into the winter months. Now, guys, you can absolutely wear this in a winter month. You would, uh, The only thing you would really need to do is probably just put, instead of this tank top, you guys can just do like a turtleneck or even a sweater. And then um, if the blazer was a little bit, like I would probably, if I did it with a heavier sweat, sweater or a turtleneck, I would add a different blazer because guys, this blazer is pretty fitted, which I don't necessarily have a problem with. But um, one thing that I don't necessarily like about this blazer are the clasp on it. I'm probably gonna change those out there silver. And as you can see, it has the, um, you know, the bronze, uh, but uh, the bronze, um, we have buttons on it. And then you have this big tacky, Look at this big tacky silver clasp. That is awful. Look at this. Let me let me show y'all. If I can even get it to, you know, if I can even get it to connect, girl. Oh, look at that. And then I'm gonna do this one. See, look at that. You see how you see that silver right there? Oh, that is. Oh, that is so tacky. Good Oh. But other than that, I don't have a problem with it. I absolutely love the sleeve detail. Look at that, how cute this is. Guys, this is a very easy, uh, you guys can achieve this look very easily. Um, it is it's simple, it looks sophisticated. But again, it's just a pair of leather pants, a simple little tank, 
and this really cute military style jacket. Um, even if you can't find a pair of leather, a leather pants, you guys can always do like a leather top. You can reverse it, do, do like a leather, green leather jacket or a, a leather jacket. You can do a plain um, tank top and then just a pair of nice slacks. So yeah guys, I absolutely love this look. I think it's so cute and so sophisticated. I'm about to unbutton this cause baby, oh, them silver class wearing me out. All right guys, so yeah, I absolutely love this look. This is so cute, it's so sexy and sophisticated. And this is going to be look number five. All right guys, so this is gonna conclude today's video. Please let me know what your favorite look was down below. Also guys, if you have a special video request, of some looks that you would like for me to put together please feel free to leave that in the comment section below also if you have not subscribed i'm gonna need you to tell me what you're waiting for and after you tell me what you're waiting for i'm gonna need you to subscribe also guys please feel free to give me a thumbs up as well as share this video thank you guys so much for watching and uh i will see you in the next one